two. friends, Hal here. That was the introduction to You've Got a Friend, the way I play it. Let's just get right into it and show you how to play this introduction the way I've tabbed it out. We've got a capo on the second fret, standard tuning, because James Taylor plays this in this key. So what we're going to do, let's look at the chords really quick. Here we've got a G chord. Now a G chord is normally played like this. I'm going to play it like this with my ring finger and my pinky third and fourth finger, like that. I'm not playing with these fingers. It's like this chord where the A string is muted. Oops, right there. But it's with this finger, like that. So what I've got is that G chord. And then the next chord I've got is C. This one here, I've got my finger still on the third fret my fourth finger on the third fret of the E string. And then we go to something called a D7 sus4. Right? What I've got is my first finger on the second string up first fret, my second finger on the third string second fret, my fourth finger on the first string third fret. That's my D7 sus4. And then I go back to G. And then I put these fingers down. And what I've got here is a C chord with a G bass. This is on the third fret, E string. My fourth uh, finger is on the third fret, E string. These two fingers are down like it was a C chord, but we're really doing that. So first fingers on the second string, first fret. Second fingers on the fourth string, second fret. That's what it looks like. Then we go to F sharp minor, which is a bar chord, and then we go to B7, and this is the one I go to. If you really wanted to, you could go to this one. Okay, so F sharp minor is a bar chord. It's like an E minor chord, second fret. And then the B7 is like an e A7 chord second fret with a bar. Now let's go to the right hand and show you exactly what I'm doing with my fingers. Now I just want to say really quick that I don't play this exactly like James Taylor does because I had to learn this very quickly. So I did my own arrangement of it, but the chords are basically the same and it sounds really good. Do this really slow. One, two, ready, go. Here's the left hand and what it looks like when I'm playing the introduction. One, two, ready, go. Now let's do a little bit of a zoomed in shot and show you how it looks with both hands. One, two, ready, go.
that's it. That's the whole introduction. So if you're interested, go to the next video and we'll talk about the whole song all the way through. Talk to you later.